Something wrong with your tea? It is tea. I detest this stuff. But this morning, I need to shake the dreams from my mind. I may also need a favor. But you don't need anything from anyone. You're known for that. One of my oldest friends has been captured by mages, forced into slavery. I heard the cry for help as I slept. I'd be happy to help. What did these mages use to capture your friend? Blood magic? A summoning circle, I would imagine. I'm sorry? My friend is a spirit of wisdom. Unlike the spirits clamoring to enter our world through the rifts, it was dwelling quite happily in the Fade. It was summoned against its will, and wants my help to gain its freedom and return to the Fade. I thought spirits wanted to find their way into this world. Some do, certainly. Just as many Orlesian peasants wish they could journey to exotic Ravain. But not everyone wants to go to Ravain. My friend is an explorer, seeking lost wisdom and reflecting it. It would happily discuss philosophy with you, but it had no wish to come here physically. Do you have any idea what the mages want with your friend? No. It knows a great deal of lore and history, but a mage could learn that simply by speaking to it in the Fade. It is possible that they seek information it does not wish to give, and intend to torture it. All right. Let's go get your friend. Thank you. I got a sense of my friend's location before I awoke. I'll mark it on our map. How can I help? Something in particular you require? I see I'm intruding. I'll be on my way. No, wait. We saw so many Red Templars at the assault on Haven. Perhaps all that was left of the Order. What we didn't see was Lord Seeker Lucius. Indeed, I've seen no hint of any Seekers amongst the Red Templars, or anywhere. I have a growing suspicion Corypheus has imprisoned them. Why imprisoned? He could just as easily have killed them. Not easily. But yes, they may be dead. But the Seekers began this war against the mages. They cannot have simply vanished. There must be a trail we can follow. Yet so far I have only discovered hints. But they could have ended up just like the Red Templars. Seekers do not use Lyrium. I assume Corypheus gained control of the Templars by corrupting the Lyrium they were already taking. To do the same to a Seeker, you'd have to force the Lyrium upon him. That may be what happened, but it couldn't have begun that way. We're missing a piece of the puzzle, Inquisitor. I need to find it. Finding them obviously means a lot to you. I don't expect you to understand. I cannot even claim that rescuing them would be beneficial, they wouldn't look kindly on the Inquisition. But even so, if there's a chance... If we can spare resources to follow up on these leads, Inquisitor, I would appreciate it. Funniest thing I've seen in years. That cat dancing around, hopping and pouncing like a fool. Made my day bright, it did. Maker knows what got into the little rat catcher. Roderick was sorry before he died. Roderick was a pebble in the Inquisition's boot. A little remorse seems only fair. Blood everywhere. Monsters, madness, dying, we're all dying. The Herald stands against it, and heads turn. Desperate and simple, pure. Voices in the Chantry. 
years since I'd sung the song and felt it flowing through me. But this is real. This is real. So long since I'd felt it. Falling, flying, faith. And I fought her. Make her forgive me. I hope I did enough. He hates it all because of the darkness behind the door. Some doors should stay shut. I'd like to talk about what happened to you before we met. Before you, Reese was my friend. He showed me I was wrong to kill the mages. I thought I was helping them. Then he and Evangeline went to Adamant, and I went with them. I was worried Evangeline would hurt Reese. We found out dangerous things. It scared Seeker Lambert, and he scared the mages. It started the rebellion. Seeker Lambert told me what I was. Reese couldn't look at me. I ran until I found more Templars. That's all. What was the spire like when the Mage Rebellion started? Dead and dying, begging and bloody. Some wanted freedom, some peace, some war. Some wanted it all to stop. Evangeline was a Templar, but she helped Reese help the others. She set them free. Adrian was a mage, but she killed mages to force the fight. She wanted blood. Reese just wanted to help, to stop people hurting. Maybe that's why he saw me. What can you tell me about Reese? He was a mage. He saw me when most couldn't, and he remembered. He helped me, and I watched over him. I worried Evangeline would hurt him. She was a Templar, but she didn't like hurting people. When I left, she stayed. Now she watches over him. They should have been with the rebels. Maybe they ran away together instead. Neither of them like killing. If you like, I could use the resources of the Inquisition to locate your friend. No. If they are alive and safe, they should stay away. The last time he saw me, he didn't want to look at me. He saw a monster. Let him forget. What did you mean when you said you killed mages? Some of the mages of the Spire wanted to die. Too sad, too scared, too much. I didn't know what I was. A ghost, I thought. Fading in the fade. When I came to them, they could see me. I used the knife to set them free. When Reese found out, he made me stop, made me understand. There were other ways to help. I didn't know. It sounds like you didn't know what you were doing. No, I killed people. I knew. I just thought I had to. They were hurting, helpless, haunted. It was all I could do. It was wrong. I was wrong. If I start again, you or Cassandra or Cullen need to kill me. What can you tell me about Adamant Fortress? It is old, full of sadness and pain. It should be torn down. The veil is thin. We found a demon there. It had touched a man and made him real again. It scared Reese and Evangeline. The man wasn't supposed to be real. Then the demon found us. It put me back in the cupboard on the bad day. Reese and Evangeline saved me. You said Seeker Lambert told you what you were. I'm hiding Reese from him, but he chants words and sees. I won't let you hurt Reese. My nose explodes, a shower of blood. Just another parasite that's wormed its way into our world, feeding off all the things you can't have. What we found at Adamant made him angry. We were the first rock rolling at the top of a mountain. He had to stop us. He killed so many. He didn't care. Cold, corrupt. So I came and killed him. If you hated Seeker Lambert, why go to the Seeker Fortress? Because he was right. I was a demon. I saw demons at Adamant. They put people in the dark, in the old hurts. I didn't want to be that. I heard the old songs of the Templars at Val Royo and followed them. If I forgot, fought, fell to felling, Templars would kill the demon. I wouldn't hurt anyone again. 
I'll talk to you later. How do you know? <laughs>